I want to discuss how to use a screenshot or a bitmap as a tracing layer. So I've started a new drawing from scratch and if I zoom out you'll see the screen rectangle. If I zoom to fit, it fits it in the drawing area. What that is is actually your terrain and that can be controlled by going to settings, program settings, and terrain. So it's a good idea to zoom to fit so you have an idea where to center your drawing. Next thing I'll do is go to file and import take the project trace image function which sends me to a directory opens up an explore window and prompts me to choose a file. My choices are bitmap, jpeg, and tga. For this we'll choose a jpeg format and double click. It now will give me the ability to scale the image as I import it. So I'm going to just go with the defaults here and my next click will insert that file. So my next step is to zoom in on one of these dimensions and we see 71 feet 7 inches from there to there. So I, with the select tool enabled, select the image, right click, say resize, I like to zoom in to this point here, get it as close as you can. Click once there, move over to the other edge. Click there, and now we see in the drawing space it says that is actually only 37 and some change. So we'll type in 71 feet 7 inches say OK and now that should be resized. We can do that over and over as many times as we want. And we see we're pretty close. I'm, I'm probably closer than that. I was just going quick there. So that's how you rescale an image and then of course you can just start drawing your walls over that. So that's how you would import a floor plan from an outside source. Then once you start uh, getting close to completion, what you can do is go to your display filter, view filter, and there's our imported image. We can just turn that off and there's your wall.